Once upon a time, in a lush, green forest, there lived a wise old lion named Grandpa Leo and his curious young grandson, Little Leo. They lived in a cozy den with a beautiful view of the forest, and every evening, Grandpa Leo would share stories with Little Leo before bedtime. One evening, as the sun dipped below the horizon and painted the sky with shades of pink and orange, little Leo scampered up to Grandpa Leo with wide eyes. Grandpa, tell me a story about bravery, he asked eagerly. Grandpa Leo smiled warmly and began. All right, little Leo, let me tell you about a time when even a small lion showed great courage and never gave up. Once upon a time, in a faraway land, there was a little lion named Leo, who lived in a peaceful village. Leo was smaller than most lions, and the other animals sometimes teased him about it. But Leo had a big heart and dreams as big as the sky. One day, a terrible storm struck the village. The wind howled, the rain poured, and the river that flowed through the village began to rise dangerously. The animals were frightened and didn't know what to do. The village elder, an old wise owl, called a meeting to discuss how to protect their homes and families. Little Leo listened carefully, and though he was small, he felt a surge of bravery. He knew that he could help. When the elder owl announced that someone needed to go to the top of the mountain to fetch a special leaf that could calm the storm, no one volunteered. The mountain was steep and treacherous, and the storm made it even more dangerous. Little Leo, however, stepped forward and said, I will go. The elder owl and the other animals looked at him with surprise. But little Leo, it's too dangerous. You're so small. Little Leo stood tall and said, I may be small, but I have a big heart, and I'm not afraid. With a determined spirit, little Leo set out on his journey. The storm raged around him, and the path was slippery and steep. He slipped and fell, but each time, he got up, brushing off the dirt and shaking off his fear. As he climbed higher, he faced fierce winds and pouring rain. At one point, he found himself hanging from a cliff edge. But he didn't give up. He used his claws to hold on tightly, and with every ounce of strength, he pulled himself up. Finally, after what seemed like forever, little Leo reached the top of the mountain. There, amidst the storm clouds, he found the glowing leaf. With the leaf secured in his paws, he made his way back down the mountain. The journey was just as perilous on the way back, but little Leo never lost hope. He knew that the safety of his village depended on him. When he returned, the animals cheered, and the elder owl placed the magical leaf in the river. The storm began to calm, and the village was safe. From that day on, the animals in the village no longer doubted little Leo's bravery. They realized that being brave doesn't mean being the biggest or the strongest. It means never giving up no matter how tough things get. And little Leo learned that with courage and determination, even the smallest lion could make a big difference. Grandpa Leo finished his story and looked at little Leo, who was now snuggled under his blanket with a thoughtful expression. Grandpa, I want to be brave like little Leo, little Leo said softly. Grandpa Leo patted him gently and replied, you already are, my dear. Remember, no matter how big or small you are, as long as you never give up, you can overcome anything. Little Leo's eyes sparkled with newfound courage as he drifted off to sleep, dreaming of his own adventures and the brave little lion who taught him that true strength comes from within. And so little Leo learned that bravery isn't about never falling. It's about rising every time you fall, no matter how small you might be.